hi guys welcome to another video this is Gwanele Mduba in this video I'm going to show you how to calculate a median for the grouped data so there's the table now the first step is to calculate the cumulative frequency which is the less than or guy the less than or guy how do you calculate the less than or guys? The first observation you put it as it is. Two plus fourteen. Sixteen. Sixteen plus twenty-nine. It's forty-five. Forty-five plus forty-three. It's eighty-eight. Eighty-eight plus thirty-three. 121 121 plus 9 it's 130 yes now the second step is to identify the median interval by finding the first cumulative frequency that exceeds the median position the first cumulative frequency that exceeds the median position now firstly we, we have to calculate or we have to find the median position so it's n over 2 n it's 130 divided by 2 n is the total divided by 2 which is equal to 65 which is the median is on the 65th position on the 65th position now we have to find the median interval by finding the first cumulative frequency that exceeds this median position the cumulative frequency is the less than archive. So we have to find the median interval by finding the first cumulative frequency, the first one that exceeds 65. So does 2 exceed 65? No. 16? Does, does 16 exceed 65? No. 45? No. 88? 88 is more than 65 so 88 is the first cumulative frequency that exceeds 65 or that is more than 65 so 88 is on the 50 to 60 interval so the median interval is 50 to 60 therefore the median interval is on 50 to 60. Now let us determine step 3 determine the median by using this formula LME, which is the lower limit of the median class, into C, which is the class width, into n over 2 minus the cumulative frequency of the preceding median class which is the cumulative frequency that is before the median class Then divide by the frequency of the median class. As you can see, this is capital letter F, which stands for the cumulative frequency, and this stands for the frequency. This is for the cumulative frequency, which is the less than archive. And this one is for the frequency. Now let us substitute. 
ME is equal to the lower limit is 50. These are the class limits. This is the lower limit and this is the upper limit. So we want the lower limit 50 plus C, which is the class width, the difference between these class limits, which is 10. 60 minus 50 is 10. That is the class limit. So N over 2, we already calculated N over 2, which gave us 65. So here it is your choice. You can put 130 over 2 or take the answer. It's up to you. So 65 minus the cumulative frequency that is before the median class. This is the median class. So the cumulative frequency that is before the median class, there's the column for the cumulative frequency. And this is the median class. So the class that is before the median class is this one. And this is the cumulative frequency that is before the median class, which is 45. over frequency of the median class this is the median class this is the cumulative frequency of the median class this is the frequency the actual frequency of the median class which is 43 please do not confuse these two this is the cumulative frequency this is the frequency so this small letter F stands for the frequency. And this one, this capital letter F stands for the cumulative frequency. So the median is 54,651. My work here is done. Until next time. Bye. Thank you.